Hey guys, uh, I'm back to do another uh, unboxing and uh, not really a review, but uh, just my thoughts. Um, so today I thought I'd uh, treat myself with a few little goodies and I went down and I picked up the new Zycar XO Cutter. I'll get this thing out of the way. Let me see if I can. Uh, this thing, yeah, this thing is solid. Like that, that's uh, one solid cutter. Has some weight to it. And again, like all the other videos, the gear mechanism, and you can see how nice the blades come together. Right. You know, there, there, yeah, there is, like, there is a bit of rattling. I don't know if you can hear that, just with the gear mechanism. But uh, anyhow, we'll we'll get back, we'll get back to this in a minute. Um, just want to explain, not not really an issue, but something that I found out just playing around. Um, and also, end up grabbing. A single torch. Get this thing out. Uh, this thing is really, really sharp. Like very nice lighter. The nice uh, kind of piano finish. And there we go. Really, really sharp looking lighter. Like I, I like that a lot. But anyhow. So, uh, I've been playing around with this, and um, th this is great. The only, really the only issue I have, and I'm, I'm kind of nitpicking here, um, the, the nice thing with these little, I don't know, whatever you're going to call them, dime store cutters, but anyway, with these guys here, so you have the backing, right? So when you go to put your cigar you know you're not going to cut off too much. It's pretty much impossible, right? Then, same thing with the uh, the Zycar uh, 1, X1. Um, what I found is I've had it uh, in some instances where if you're in an area that's, uh, you know, not really lit well in the lounge or, or somewhere where you don't have really great lighting. Um, this is really easy to cut the cigar. This guy here, again, pretty easy. Find a flat surface, put your cigar down, done. And you'll get a, a really good cut. The issue with this guy is you can't do that anymore. So if uh, for example, uh, in my garage, um, obviously, you know, uh, not smoking in the house, um, where the lighting, uh, in the evening, it's really hard to see. So in order for me to get a proper cut, uh, I really need a good light source because it is very, very easy. Uh, I found to cut too much. But again, you know, you, you can't really put it down, put the cigar, because you, you'll cut way too much. Um, you know, it's kind of like a little, uh, a little cheat that I use if if I'm in a uh, in a backyard or somewhere somewhere in the late evening. Simply open it, put it flat, put your cigar, boom, done. So now to get adjusted with this guy, um, can't do that anymore. Um, that that's really the only. Um, the only thing that I really, really have a bit of an issue with, but other than that, I mean, this thing, this thing is great, you know, really nice cutter. And again, even with, with a single torch, like this is a really, really, th this one I, I didn't really need, but <laughs> it just looks so sharp and, uh, I just wanted it. But, uh, as my lighters keep piling up, <laughs> But uh, anyhow, 
just thought I'd do something a little different uh, tonight for you guys, and that is about it. So, if you're looking for a nice cutter, this thing, hands down, is phenomenal. Uh, like I said, the only thing in a poor lighting area, uh, it's you got to be careful, or or it's very simple to cut more uh, off the cap than than you'd like. All right, that's it, guys. Have a good evening. Cheers.